My final project is a film festival. Uh, it's going to be held in the university campus, but obviously with all this that's going on, that's not able to happen. So I've had to make changes to that. I've had to change it from being a physical festival to being an online festival. In the end, my film festival went ahead and it was a brilliant success. So I've had to try and find structure, which has been difficult, um, you know, of finding somewhere that's actually suitable to work at home has been has had its own challenges. But I've tried to keep my days as as normal as possible really. Usually on my drive to uni, um, I'd be thinking a lot, thinking about my project, and I found that that drive quite a good time to consider things, um, work through things in my mind, um, actually come up with some good ideas. Um, obviously, that's not been possible now with being stuck in the house, so I've been going on lots of walks. I'm very lucky because I'm living in County Fermanagh, which is full of lakelands and beautiful scenery. Um, so I've been taking advantage of that. When it's come to my work, um, there's the staff and my, my supervisor has been fantastic. She couldn't have done any more really. Every time I've needed help, she's been there. She's always made herself available. We've had lots of online lectures, online meetings. Well, we talked about like the importance of securing an offline location because that would open up an opportunity for you to have like face-to-face -face interactions. You could have a ceremony and it would generate a lot of buzz and you've obviously been forced to move the festival online but because everyone's in lockdown and everyone's hungry for content it seems that that has played to your advantage do you think that's right yeah so all in all it's not been an ideal situation but i think the way the university have handled it and um, with going virtual has been really good um, a lot better than i expected and thank you university of ulster thank you